Joe Rogan's most infamous conspiracies. Joe Rogan is a stunningly well-known podcaster, and his digital broadcast The Joe Rogan Experience is regularly one of, if not the, most paid attention to web recordings on the planet. It's not difficult to see the reason why. But this has driven Rogan to a few wild perspectives on the world, some of which go to the extent they could be called tinfoil hat. Number 1 Alex Jones has gotten so many things right. This is Rogan's greatest debate to date and brought both him and Spotify a tremendous measure of reaction from various outlets. In October, 2020, Rogan had conspiracy theorist and noted crazy individual Alex Jones on his digital recording as a visitor. Jones is generally known for guaranteeing that the public authority is placing synthetic compounds in the water that turn the dagnap frogs gay. Jones additionally scandalously bothered Sandy Hook casualties families, parroting a customary fanatic idea that they were paid crisis actors. This cost Jones $126,000 from a defamation suit and drove to a limited extent to his prohibition on each significant web-based media platform. Rogan, in any case, kept on Jones all through, fact-checking a large number of his more crazy claims. At certain places, Rogan gestured along to Jones' explanatory fever dream. However he was generally speaking steady with regards to not following Jones excessively far down the conspiracy rabbit hole. Number 3 The moon landing was faked. For quite a while, Rogan kept up with that the moon landing was a fake. He regularly discussed narratives he had seen that persuaded him. The US would kill to dominate the space race, it is totally reasonable that they would have faked an arrival assuming it implied a success. Rogan has since come around on his perspectives, saying simply that he had recently checked out the proof without objectivity and that, whenever he had attempted to be pretty much as unbiased as could be expected, he understood he had been off base thus adjusted his perspective. If everyone could do the same when forming an opinion then the world would be better place. Number 2 No Vaccines Necessary most likely the second greatest conspiracy for Rogan was his April 2021 affirmation that healthy individuals don't need to be vaccinated against diseases. At a certain point, Rogan effectively suggested his young audience members not get vaccinated, saying, if you're like 21 years old, and you say to me, should I get vaccinated? I'll go no dot. His thinking, if you're a healthy person, and you're exercising all the time, and you're young, and you're eating well, like, I don't think you need to worry about this. The suggestion that only sick people need immunizations shows a totally different comprehension of how antibodies work and what they are really going after, to specify obliviousness of asymptomatic transporters and the basic need for herd immunity. Rogan rushed to, somewhat, withdraw his assertions after censures by well-being authorities, saying, I'm not a doctor, I'm AF, Moran, and I'm a cage-fighting commentator. I'm not a respected source of information. Number 4 South African White Genocide One of the more radical intrigues Rogan has proliferated is the completely exposed case of white genocide in South Africa. The conspiracy asserted that white South Africans were being designated by black South Africans and killed as retribution for politically sanctioned racial segregation. The issue is that the scheme was at first spread by dangerous white nationalist group Afriforum, and twisting of a deliberate misinterpretation of the nation's homicide statistics. Afterwards Rogan he tweeted, the more I've looked at it objectively the more I think that violence is just a huge problem in general in South Africa and that many people have isolated the statistics on farmers and it makes it seem like they are being targeted. Subscribe to get smarter. Comment what question you would want to see answered.